a man called Ray Epps, who's now a hero on the left and funded by the Democratic Party, et cetera. But take the politics out of it. What is that? Here you have a guy on camera repeatedly saying, we're going to the Capitol. We need to go into the Capitol. Into the Capitol. And he's not in jail when people who who didn't go into the Capitol are in jail. I, I don't. What do you make of that? Um, again, that's that's something I actually address in the book. It's funny. There's a lot in here. So my concern with that, and I look at it from a chief of police point of view, is you have somebody that's down, and I believe he's right near the old executive office building on the 5th, the day before January 6th, talking to a group of people, talking about we have to get into the building. We have to get in the building. And then the next day to see him at what's called the Pennsylvania Avenue gate. It's one of the two fence lines I had down at the, uh, the West Front. Um, and he, he's there and he clearly sees the banner, the um, uh, metal crowd control barriers that are up with the signs saying restricted, you know. And so he knows that's a restricted area. And he's up there and you see him lean in and he whispers in somebody's ear and he covers his mouth in such a way so you can't read his lips or anything. Whispers in somebody's ear and that person moments later is, atta- is attacking my officers. That's suspicious as hell to me. I, I raised a lot of concerns. What is that? You know, and what's interesting is I believe. Um, and, and that's that's verified. The person into whose ear he whispered. Yeah, I think if you watch the video, you yeah. see that and, you know, that person immediately go and start start pulling on the gate and start you know fighting with the officers. And what's interesting is when I believe he went on 60 minutes and on 60 minutes, um, what he said was he went up to the officer and he told that officer, these officers are on our side. Don't hurt these officers. I believe that was pretty much in, in, in not verbatim. But don't hurt these officers. They're on our side. Don't don't hurt these officers. Well, if that's the case, why would you cover your mouth and not yell it to everybody? Because it didn't seem like that protester was the only one that was possibly going to be hurting the officers. We had a whole bunch of people next to him. Why wouldn't you tell it to the whole group? I don't, I don't know. I, I, I know that Epps is being encouraged by partisan Democrats to sue people who raise these questions, but they're fair questions and I'm going to raise them anyway. How, given that tape, could the January 6th committee defend Ray Epps, which they, which they did. It doesn't make any sense to me. Yeah. I'm having trouble answering that one. I, I don't know. 